Ordinarily, Drew Larson's story ideas came, on the increasingly rare occasions when they came at all, a little at a time like dribbles of water drawn from a well that was almost dry. And there was always a chain of associations he could trace back to something he'd seen or heard, a real-world flashpoint. In the case of his most recent short, the genesis had come when he'd seen a man changing a tire on the Falmouth entrance ramp to I-295, the guy down in an effortful squat while people honked and swerved around him. That had led to blowout, labored over for almost three months, and published after half a dozen rejections at larger magazines, in Prairie Schooner, 